Hi, this is Tyler Erickson uh, with Top Notch Taxidermy and in this short video I'm going to show you <clears throat> how I finish and paint the eye on a white-tailed deer. Um, I'll bring the video in here and kind of show you, but I've already got all the epoxy work done. I got the this lower lid here epoxied and I've got uh, I built a little caruncle gland in there and I built in my nictitating membranes with um, epoxy first and then just a little repair in the tear duct area and stuff here so I'm make sure that your eye sets right you don't want your front corner of your eye to come to your glass it should come way out here to a point and then your glands lay in there and your membrane behind that I'll show you the other side it looks pretty crappy now but uh, we're going to change that. want to get away from just a quick black or quick brown painting of the eyes. Just ugly that way. We've already got our nose pad done here. Show you that quick. If you haven't seen it yet, go ahead and download our nose, stream the nose. Nose pad video, I just finished that, that up. And the nose pads are just fantastic on these things. And they will make you money. And win you some ribbons if you are into competing. But now we're going to work on the eye. And what I've done here, like I said, I did all my... Uh, done all my epoxy work. And then what I like to do is take a masking compound. I've just got latex rubber here. It can be <clears throat> whatever masking compound you like to use. I didn't use this for years but I just started using it and I think it does save me time. But what I'm going to do is just brush that on the eye. I've already cleaned that glass with paper towel and uh, Windex cleaned it from any clay or any glue residue that was on there for mounting the deer or any epoxy residue from when we did our epoxy work there doesn't have to be